highlight the XY plane, look along Z, go into the sketching tab, <coughs> oval, make sure the first two lines are coincident with the horizontal axis, and then specify the radius. And then create a construction point on this edge. So you should see the C and then create that point. And now I'll go in and if I try to dimension the edge, you know, it, it, uh, it selects that entire edge. So what I have to do is I have to dimension the horizontal distance between points. So I'll deselect that. So I'm selecting only points now. So I'll select that point and that point. That's my first dimension. And that point and that point. And that's my second dimension. And then I can make these, you know, I can make these whatever. You can see that they are independent of each other. So let's say this is 5, this is 5. And I'll also um, dimension this radius. And I'll call that, say, two. Okay, and I'll say zoom to fit. And then um, the only thing left is to dimension the distance of this point from the axis or from some other location. So I'll say horizontal and I'll select the axis and then I'll select this point. And then now, you first of all, you notice that the whole sketch is highlighted in blue which means that it's well-defined. So this is a well-defined sketch. And now if I change that to, say, 10, you see the entire slot moves together.